So I'm thinking we need to change our name. Why'd you say that? Hey, Maeda. Huh? Have you ever really seriously thought about the future? No, you know I haven't. Don't you think it's a little unwise not to think about the future at all? But we're still only sophomores in high school. Exactly how far in the future are you saying I should be thinking? How about getting a job, for starters? You know what? I don't have to take that from someone with that ridiculous hairstyle. Just take a look at this, okay? A yearbook? I found it yesterday in the back of my closet. It has my childhood dream written inside it if you want to read it. Could you read it aloud? Sure thing. Let me see. Shinjiro Hayashida says I'd like to be a frog when I grow up. I guess you were a weird kid. For the life of me, I have no idea why I would have said something like that. But I guess the one thing that I know for certain is that I've always known that I never wanted to have an ordinary life. And even though life has taken me down the path of delinquency, I still have faith that one day I'll get it. What are you guys talking about? Oh, Kamiyama. We were just talking about what we wanted for the future. I wasn't saying anything, though. What about you, man? Future? I'm definitely not thinking about the future. Sometimes it's all I can do to just make it through the day. That's really weird. I had you picked as a guy who's so down to earth he's always planning ahead. Well, I stopped doing that planning stuff when I enrolled in this school. I just felt like it was necessary to put a lot of that stuff behind me. More to the point, I've been able to start thinking I don't care in a good way. Just take a look outside the windows. Huh? Think about it rationally. Aren't you several hundred times more curious about what's going to happen to those guys than what's going to happen to you? You're right. I'm curious about who's going to employ them. Come on, do you really think it matters where they end up working? I know everyone has their own set of problems. But when I look at a gorilla who's enrolled in high school, my problems tend to seem small. You know, you're right. It seems pretty silly to worry about me. In conclusion, everyone tends to think about things from their own perspective alone. But the world is a big place. In other words, you're saying that our personal concerns are insignificant, right? That's exactly right. But still, Kamiyama... What is it, Mata? It's only natural for us to worry about the future if we're going to a stupid delinquent school like this. We gotta worry that we'll never get ahead if we graduate from this place. If that's the case, you need to look out the window again. Huh? <laughs> Stop it. Why are they tossing him in the air? Are they celebrating? I don't know why. But the one thing I do know is that these people don't worry for even a millisecond about what their future's gonna be like. When I see those guys acting like that, it puts my concerns into perspective. Oh yeah, I certainly have learned a lesson. None of my concerns can stand up to those guys. Still I. Do you have something to say? Even if they're a bunch of losers, I still worry about me. You are a chronic worrier, and yet you are also a delinquent. Listen to me, delinquents don't have any future in the first place. That was a cruel thing to say. If you still don't get it after that blunt explanation, you need to look outside the window again. This will make you feel better. Oh my god! mother. We'll end the Cromartie High School anime with this episode. Thank you for watching these past four years. We only aired for six months. It's fixed! Please input your name following the voice instructions. Uh, what a pain.